I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low-gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? Are we playing security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not. Spectre status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay E-24. Emergency civilian housing. Hey there. Alien forces. Hey. Looking mighty low today. You okay? Has this anyone been bothering you? No. It's not that. I'm fine. Ah, uh, I see. Uh, so, any news? No. They just. Their shuttle must be real slow. That's all. You think they're okay? They promised they'd come get me, no matter what they had to do. So long. I don't know, kid. But I'm sure they'd be happy knowing you're safe. It's just... I miss them. I miss them so much. Mm-hmm. I believe those are my credits. I know, I know. You don't have to say anything. But I'm about to make my comeback. I believe those are my credits. I found a Prothean Sphere on Gay Hinnom. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. Yes, thank you. I'll call them right now. Son of a bitch. Straining existing resources. The council reports that food shortages may happen in the near future. Status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at ward level, Purgatory. I recovered the code of the Ancients from Dakuna. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. With shock and joy, really, this is wonderful news. Thank you, human. Sincerely. This will greatly aid our people. Anyhow, enough about my armor. Let's find the gang and celebrate while I'm still here. Where'd you park? I took rapid transit. Come on, you have the fanciest ride on the Citadel. And I saw that new paint job. I, uh, I sold it a couple of weeks ago. What? But you love that car. I know. You never shut up about that car. I know. I always thought this place would be cool if it didn't involve so much walking. If you're in pain, I could carry you. <laughs> Pass. What the hell's your problem? I'm not skinning the Alliance. Well, since when are you so chummy with those pricks? Screw you. You've been watching the news? Sure. Know what's happening to Earth while we're sitting here? Calm down already. Spectre 
receptor status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Excuse me. I recovered the rings of a loon. They're waiting in Bay D-24. That's wonderful. Thank you. My people will treat this miraculous find as a call to support their local hospitals. I came across this treatment plan at a chemical plant. Could it help? Treatment? What is... I've never seen this kind of process before. Huh. Probably experimental. It's a long shot, but let's run some tests and see if it might work for our patient. Yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. He's already awake and responsive. Actually, I found a Cacliosaur skull preserved in amber. Maybe you could clone it, or... You're kidding? You're kidding. Seriously? Well, um, if, if the genetic material is intact, we could... Hmm. We've got cloning facilities on Sirkesh. Cacliosaur genes were remarkably pliable. Cloning might be effective. I got your message, Miranda. Is this about your sister? Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. I don't like secrets, Miranda. Just tell me what's going on. I can't, Shepard. If that's a problem, I'll go. Don't. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. You'll have your access, Miranda. But I don't like the sound of this. I know. And thank you. It means a lot. That's not the only thing you wanted to talk about, is it? No. I need to tell you something. Confess, really. It's been eating away at me. Confess? <sighs> when I headed the Lazarus Project to rebuild you, I wanted to implant a control chip in you as a safeguard. I think you mentioned this. I did. There's more to it. The elusive man stopped me. Sounds like it would have saved him a lot of trouble. Maybe. He didn't want to interfere with who you truly were. Something that just obeyed orders. He wanted Commander Shepard. Installing the chip might have ruined you. I understand why you wanted to. I was a complete unknown. I've never had to deal with that many black boxes on a project. I felt blind. Why bring that up now? I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me, right down to my bloody DNA. After I got out of there, I couldn't stand by and let it happen to my sister. I risked my life to get her away from all that. Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have changed me in a thousand different ways. But you didn't. 
I don't know how, but you brought me back. Thanks. But with so much being uncertain, I just wanted you to know I always regretted wanting that chip. You can't keep beating yourself up over the past. I usually don't. But this was important. Some things you just don't have control over. Guess my fancy genetics can't help me there. No, they can't. Okay. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. Of course. And Miranda, this thing you have to do. Good luck. Don't worry, Shepard. I always have a plan. Hold this from a Geth jamming tower. Maybe you can use it. How the hell did you... Well, never mind. Tech like this? I don't care where it came from. I'll have my people run with this. When the war comes back here, maybe we can save more lives. This is a nice spot, Ash. Yeah. All the shuttles that being around remind me of when my dad would get ready to ship out. My mom would bundle us all up, buy us ice cream, and cart us out to the shipyard to watch his transport depart. I still have to resist waving every time a big Alliance ship flies by. You should bring Sarah up here. I will, when she's ready. She'll like the quiet. She wasn't the loud tomboy crashing around like I was. Sounds like you were a handful. Maybe. My dad got me. Jamie never met him. He would have liked you. You think so? A badass military woman? Definitely. He would have tried to use his irresistible Williams charm on you. My mom would have laughed until he waved her away. Yeah. Yeah, he would have invited you over, cooked you something on the grill, and talked your ear off. Ever think about what life would have been like outside the Alliance? Oh, sure. Tried to rebel against the whole military family thing when I was growing up. When my dad and I got into it, I'd threaten to run away with the next guy that came along. <laughs> really? He'd laugh and say, Good, I'll pack your damn bags myself. That tended to deflate me pretty quick. He knew I'd never stray far from the family. They're everything to me. It's easy to forget what we fight for. Yeah, moments like that. This was a good idea. Nice to get away from the war for a while. I do feel a little guilty, though. Sure. But sometimes you have to step away or risk going crazy. Too late. <laughs> no argument here. You're a crappy commander. You're a crappy commander... Ma'am. Copy that. Hello, Shepard. Putting aside centuries of hostility, the Geth and Warriors have both agreed to help fight the forces. Of course. We can have ships at the colony in 36 hours. Do you need medical support? No. Evacuating the colony is more than enough. Thank you, Ambassador. Ambassador? I'm coordinating actions for the fleet while we're here. Evacuating colonies, bolstering Turian defense lines. Huh. I think it was right here. Three years ago to the day. What? This was where Saren's assassins fired at me. I'd just gotten to the Citadel. I didn't think I needed my barriers up. My mistake. You never told me about this. How bad was it? Got me in the arm. They used polonium rounds. I was running a fever in minutes. It was the first time I'd been really hurt on my pilgrimage. I ran to the Council Embassy, asked for protection, offered the data on Seren. 
The Turian clerk called me Soot Rat. He threatened to have me tossed off the station if I didn't leave. I wish that clerk could see you now. He just did. That was him back there. I don't think he remembers me. And you're assisting him in spite of that? This war is too big for old grudges. You showed me that. We are at peace with the Geth. I can't waste my time on a Turian who made me angry. Besides, it all worked out. I made it to the wards. You found me. Happy ending. And now the Turians will get the aid they desperately need. I nearly reminded him who I was. Made him apologize, rubbed his nose in it. Maybe he and I both needed to grow up a little. The difference is that you helped when it counted. Thanks, Shepard. So did you. I've recovered the obelisk of Karza. It's waiting for you in Bay D-24. You have? It's amazing! Thank you, Commander. That's going to help immeasurably with some very sensitive work. Excuse me. I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. A Reaper code fragment? Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. Urgently. Human, I must speak to you on behalf of my people. What is it? Holding sorrow. Takuna. My home world, the Reapers have come. Holding sorrow, our warriors are under siege, but your forces can rescue them. Urgently, please. All the other races have turned us aside. How do your people fight? Proudly, with BI assisted infantry. Our soldiers carry heavy weapons into battle mounted on their backs. Mixed pride and shame, our enemies have called us living tanks, as well as names less flattering. I'll take the Normandy as soon as we have time. Relief. Thank you, Commander. Small hope. Perhaps we can evacuate some of our civilians when your forces arrive. Anxiously, I will remain here for news. Please hurry. Takuna burns. I have excellent news. Your daughter's paperwork has been processed. What? You said it was impossible. How did you pull it off? Well, I talked to a few friends, called in a few favors, maybe even stayed up a few nights. I wasn't sure I could pull it off, but everything's in order, and your daughter leaves for Thessia tomorrow. A caretaker will travel with her to ensure she reaches her relatives back on the homeworld. Thank you. Thank you so much. Why don't you go spend the time you have left with her? I'll take care of the rest. I want all remaining files secured and marked for Tentron clearance only. Commander Shepard, thank you for coming. Did you find something? The Council has ordered a full review into Donald Udina's activities. We're still piecing together his coup attempt. But that isn't why I asked you here. The situation is growing urgent for my people. We're aware your Crucible is still missing a key component. The Catalyst. Do you know something? Not exactly, but there is a... Artifact on our homeworld, Thessia, known only to highest levels of my government. What is it? With any luck, it's a means to help you locate the Catalyst. 
The artifact is kept in a temple located at these coordinates. I've ordered a scientific team to meet you there. If this artifact is so important, why keep it hidden? Every species in the Citadel has its secrets, Commander. But this one, in the wrong hands, would upset the balance of galactic power. The Reapers are doing that right now. Which is why I'm bringing this to you. I appreciate the help. It's you who will be helping us. The Matriarchs are growing desperate. For the first time in our history, Thessia is vulnerable. For all our intellect, we're outmatched by Reaper firepower. I'll do what I can. Whether you know it or not, you've become the sole ray of hope in a very dark night. Goddess be with you. <laughs>